Mike Schmitz of Draft Express here with Angelo Nunez. Just finished up a great game and a, and a big win over Santa Vida. How did you feel you played out here? Uh, I feel very good. The team played so well. We did a nice job and I think we can get this job with next game. What is your role on this team? What is? What is your role on this team? Uh, we play team, teamwork. We do every, everyone together, so we, we did a nice job today. So you were here last year as well? Yeah. How, how, are, you, how are you different as a player uh, this year than you were last year? I think last year I didn't have any experience, so this year I came here with more focus. I know the, the teams, I know the tournament, so I felt so good. I felt better. And, and we saw you at the, the Jordan Grand Classic in, in Brooklyn as well. Um, how have you changed as a player since then, and what was that experience like for you? I think I've grown a little bit, and uh, I'm play, I play well. I think I'm, I improved on my shot. Uh, my pass, my skills, so I think I'm a different player than I was there. Yeah, for people who maybe don't know much about you, what can you tell us about your background, where you're from, how you ended up in Barcelona, all that? Uh, I'm from Brazil. I have 16 years old. I'm one year younger. And uh, I think I'm hard working. I work so hard. I play aggressive, so uh, I can say to you I'm very aggressive in the, in the court. Did, did you come from a family of athletes? Or anyone? Yeah, yeah. You can say this. They they weren't professional, but my everyone in my family played. My brother, my, my mom, and my dad. And how did you? What brought you from Brazil, um, you know, to to Barcelona? Uh, I, I they invite me when I was younger, when I was 13. So I I thought it was a good experience because here the basketball in Europe is different than America, and I think I, I have to learn the other side of the basketball. So to read the, how to read the game and all this, I think here in Spain it's the most proper play to. And we saw you playing a little bit on the ball, even at a pick and roll, um, then off the ball. So what position do you see yourself playing long term and what do you think your biggest strengths are? I think in open court I can be a point guard, but in middle court I can be a shooting guard. So I think I can do both of them like very good and I can defense like in the three positions. And where are you at right now in terms of your height and your weight and your wingspan, if you know that? Yeah, my wingspan is two meters and one of centimeters. I'm at 198 and I have 92 kilograms. And what are the biggest areas you think you still have room to improve? I think on my shot, on the free throw, uh, more and more impressive. But I think I, I have to improve a little bit of everything. So there is not only one thing I need to improve. And what is your goals for the next couple of years here? Um, where do you hope to end up? Uh, I hope play well the camps that I go, play well in nice tournaments like the, or the Hospitalet, and uh, maybe play in ACB in the next two years. I think this is the most goal I can, I can achieve. Do you see more kids even going to the States for, for college? On, is that something you've ever considered? Maybe. We'll see. I don't know. The future I can tell you I mean, yeah. that I will do, but I can think about it. And do you follow the NBA game closely? Is there anyone you like to watch? I like to watch Westbrook because he's very aggressive, so I like this game. So.